It has been a sad week for the Belton community as they grieve the loss of one of their own. That's right. Classes have been canceled at the high school for students to take the time to remember Joe Ramirez. Fox 44's Jessica Rivera spoke with the school district and shares with us the next steps for the campus. Jessica. Adam Belton High School made the decision this afternoon to cancel classes tomorrow. They did say students will return to school on Monday, May 9th. We know that schools can't function if students and staff don't feel safe. That's that's paramount. It is our highest priority at all times. Security has been on the mind of many parents after the death of Joe Ramirez. Case and Allison is accused of stabbing him in the chest Tuesday morning. Additional adult presence in the hallway, um, refocusing traffic in the high school so that kids aren't congregating all at the same time, um, things of that nature. Belton High School is working closely with the police department as this is an ongoing investigation. Operating fully with the Belton police, and yes, we can't speak about the ongoing investigation, but there will be areas of the school that um, students are not going to be allowed in. The death of Joe Ramirez has the entire community hurting. Belton ISD and Region 12 are working on providing resources for staff and students to heal. We have um, many wonderful community partners um, for counseling services outside of school, but we will um, we will provide that as long as it's needed. Students and family will receive the weekly campus communication from Principal Ben Smith with more information about plans for next week. The community has organized a fundraiser for Joe Ramirez on the 11th at Puerto de Jalisco in Temple. The funeral for Joe is scheduled for 2 p.m. next Thursday at Crossroads Church in Belton. We'll have the details on our website for now. In the studio, Jessica Rivera, Fox 44 News. Thanks, Jessica.